where is Titan TV man? Elite cameraman is going to analyze. Anal anal bro, I do that every single time. Anyways, y'all, welcome back to another one. I ain't going to lie. I got a little stomach ache today. So I don't know if I'm going to upload three times. I probably will. But I'm just letting y'all know just in case it seemed like I'm a little less energy, which probably it, it don't matter. I ain't going to lie. Belly ache don't really make me stop talking. But I'm just letting y'all know, bro. I'm being honest, bro. This is, this is me communicating with y'all. All right. So let's get into the video. Hello, everyone. Elite Cameraman here. It's been a long while ever since we've seen anything about Titan TV, man. Sure. And we haven't even got... We don't, we, don't, we don't even know what's going on with him. ...gotten a glimpse of him getting fixed after his big loss in episode 47. Yeah, and at least with, 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 with Titan Cameraman, we see, we have seen a lot of him getting repaired. Like, we got to see that process, so we already knew what was good. Infected Titan Speaker Man really did him dirty. And weirdly, in episode dirt. 65, he did the same dirty trick on the imposter G-Man toilet. Mm -hmm, you got to watch him. He really the assassin road class. They don't, they don't, they're not really good for much except for sneaking people. Bros, like, And I'm talking about like people, his power level, right? You can't really compare Titan Speaker Man to regular toilets. Like the way to scale him would be with people who's in his class. So like Titan level. And when it comes to the Titans, he's not really tanky. He don't really got the most damage output. He just kind of fast and agile. Got a head stabbing streak. But even though Titan TV man is hurt pretty badly, hopefully unlike my father, the elite cameraman senior, Titan TV man will come back. Today we'll talk about when and how Titan TV man might come back. This will include my theories on the upcoming episodes and what type of upgrades could the Titan TV man could have gotten in the meantime. True. So before I get into all this, probably bigger speakers, uh, a more a platinum UHD QLED screen. You know what I'm saying? Make sure so something amazing. Sure to subscribe and like the video. Before I felt like if you want he had a regular flash screen. Now we're gonna give him that Samsung thirty thousand. Oh 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 oh. Let's see Titan TV man return soon. What are you we all have been at? waiting for Titan TV what? Man's return for almost 20 episodes at this point. I mentioned that my guess on when he might come back on one of my videos a few weeks back and from the looks of it, it might actually turn out to be true. Because everything has been leading up to a loss for the Alliance and someone has to save them unless Defuk is planning an actual defeat for the Alliance. Also, with Titan Cameraman being heavily injured in episode 65, we can clearly say that the Alliance will be overpowered. Especially with the upgraded scientist toilet teaming up Look, with the uh -huh. real G-Man. We don't even know how strong he is, like, physically. It's just his IQ is insane. Toilet. We haven't even seen the real G-Man toilet's upgrades. And you can be goddamn sure that they'll be crazy powerful. He'll most likely be at a point where he can be on equal terms with upgraded Titan Cameraman's Prime. Because last time he was a little weaker than him and his upgrades should get him up there this time. But that's not our main topic because the story is in such a place right now that Yo, the Alliance smacked. needs every last bit of help they can get to push through their struggles. Indeed. We all know that even though Titan Speaker Man is powerful, he won't be able to do much against the scientist toilet duo alone. To explain when I think Titan TV Man might return and why, I need to explain my theory on what's going to happen in the next two or three episodes. But before that, Sorry let's talk about where he could have been all this time. After teleporting at the end of episode 47, Titan TV Man literally vanished out of existence and we haven't gotten any clues Probably went to the TV room. as to where he could be right now. My main guess is that he is with Scientist Cameraman right now because from the looks of it, Scientist Cameraman have been improving a lot and their use of technology is far superior compared to everyone else. Fact. We've seen what the upgrades Titan Cameraman got 17 episodes ago can do, and after that they proved that they can do a lot better stuff now with the Mech Scientist Cameraman and Glitch Plunger Cameraman. Indeed. All these knowledge combined, they are probably producing upgrades that are so crazy powerful, which might actually allow the upgraded Titan TV man to two versus one, the scientist toilet duo. But we'll get to that in a second. I don't think we'll get to see Titan TV man return in episode 66. And to be honest, I don't think we'll get a big fight in episode 66. We probably I was about to say it was the end of the season, so we're not going to see a lot of crazy stuff. We won't get to see what happens to Titan cameraman in episode 66. But instead, we'll most likely see the rest of the Alliance getting ready for the fight. We might even get to see them pushing through Skibidi toilets to get to where the Titans are, or we might see them marching towards the real Skibidi toilets base where the scientist toilet is at. I think in the next three episodes, we'll get to see the powerful members of the Alliance form a team that will include my beloved TV woman. My beloved is nuts, bro. My beloved speaker woman. Bro, you can't, so you hopping from how you going? All right, what are you about to say about the camera woman? 
my beloved camera okay so they just all you about love it all right so you just a thought understood woman glitch plunger cameraman dark speaker man Bro, i can't wait for the all the special agents to be able to yeah yeah the team up is gonna be mad you know it's gonna happen it's gonna be the avengers episode mech scientist cameraman and most importantly i'm hoping to see simp cameraman return with his villain alpha male arc I think this team will be the main attack force helping Titan Speaker Man dealing with the scientist toilet and G-Man toilet because I really don't think that they'll be stopping after obliterating Titan Cameraman so easily. Right. We also might see them actually plan something out because at this point, the Alliance needs to get a little more careful with their moves and realize that the Skibidi toilets are getting smarter and smarter every day. I think in episode 67, the next big fight will happen, and I don't think the Alliance will stand a chance even with everyone there. They'll most likely deal a lot of damage, but I really don't see a reality where they can win alone. But just like the twist in episode 65, where it seemed like the Titans were winning the fight and ended mm. up losing big time. In episode 67, I think something similar will happen, and at the end of the episode, right when the Alliance is about to lose, upgraded Titan TV man will most likely return after 20 episodes with some crazy upgrades. He'll most likely. I'm not gonna lie. He's gonna come back the strongest easily, and then and then Cameraman gonna come back the strongest after that. So it's gonna be good, bro. Teleport into the. Back. I really hope we get to see the factions fight, bro. I hope Skibid goes so long that there's like a whole subplot of TV versus camera. Battlefield and stop an attack and deal a huge blow, ending the episode and leaving us with another cliffhanger. And in episode 68, we'll get the conclusion to this boss fight arc. Let's assume that my theories are true and all these happen. Only one question remains. What upgrades will the Titan TV man get? As you guys know, he is mostly a melee combat guy and all the other Titans have gotten some hand cannons. I think he'll be getting some blasters. I don't know if he'll get hand cannons, but it'll be something that'll shoot projectiles. It would be- A projectile? I don't know. I don't see him having a projectile, to be honest. I just see him enhancing everything he already has. So like stronger, sharper blades, uh, just more protection because Loki TV is Loki tanky, bro. He's a little tanky. Cool if his spikes on his back. He's more of an AOE support kind of guy, too, if you really think about it. I got some upgrades, and they could be both used as laser blasters and spikes at the same time. Oh, that'd be interesting. Which would make him look very cool. Other than this, his TV will 100% get some upgrades. Hopefully, he gets a LCD, OLED, QHD, 8K, IPS TV head to finesse the toilets. He also most likely get an extra TV beam power just like TV woman because if she can have it. Why can't he? One thing I'm not sure is if he'll get the cinema man upgrades back because the speakers he was using as armor are being used by scientist toilet right now and we might see a different type of armor upgrade instead of speakers. I about to say TV man got to get back. He going to have to be the one to fight scientists. Either way. And care man going to fight Jimmy. Hey, we all know. So there's one more boss missing. Oh, that once he comes back. He'll be the most overpowered existence after the secret agent in the Skibidi Toilet universe. Make sure to subscribe with notifications on if you enjoyed the video. Elite Cameraman out. That was Elite Cameraman's analysis of where TV Man is. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video right here. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment. I already know what you guys want, bro. Madness. There's a lot of stuff. Trust me, we're going to do it all. Just be patient. I'll see you on the next one. Bro. Peace out.